Welcome to pre math. In this video, we have got this uh, square O A B C fully inscribed uh, in a quarter circle with the center O, as you can see in this uh, diagram, such that the area of this uh, square O A B C has been given to us as 123 centimeter square. And now our task is uh, to calculate the area of this uh, green shaded region, this area and uh, this area combined. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. And please keep in mind that this figure may not be 100% true to the scale. Let's go ahead and get started. And here's our very first step. Let's focus on this uh, square OABC. Since this is a square, so that means all these uh, side lengths uh, are uh, equal uh, across the board. And here's our action plan to calculate uh, the area of this uh, grain shaded region. We must find uh, this uh, radius of this uh, quarter circle. This is the radius uh, and likewise this is the radius as well. Let me label this radius as lowercase r and this is going to be lowercase r as well. And now let's recall the area of a square formula, area equal to S square, where S represents the side length of the square. And in our case, uh, the area of the square has been given to us as 123. So let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this uh, formula. So S square is going to be equal to 123. Let's undo this uh, square by taking a square root uh, on uh, both uh, sides and we can see this square square root undo each other so that means uh, side length s uh, turns out to be square root of uh, 123 so therefore the side length uh, of this uh, square is going to be square root of 123 likewise square root of uh, 123 square root of uh, 123 and finally square root of 123 across the board. And in this uh, next step, I have connected this center O with this uh, vertex uh, B, as you can see in this uh, diagram. And as a result, we got this uh, right triangle uh, OAB. And now let's focus uh, on this uh, triangle uh, OAB. And we can see that this uh, OB is the radius uh, of this uh, quarter circle. Let me label uh, this radius as uh, lowercase r. So therefore the side lengths uh, of this triangle OAB are lowercase r, square root of 123 and square root of 123 as well. And now we are going to apply the Pythagorean theorem on this triangle. And here's our Pythagorean theorem, a square plus b square equal to c square. And in our case, uh, this OB is the hypotenuse. So let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this uh, Pythagorean formula. So we're going to have a square root of uh, 123 whole uh, square plus uh, once again square root of uh, 123 whole uh, square equal to r square. And here we can see square and square root undo each other. So we ended up with the 123. Likewise, square and square root uh, undo each other as well. So this is going to be 123 as well. So therefore we got uh, 123 plus uh, 123 equal to r square. And let's combine these like terms. So r square is going to be equal to 246. Let me go ahead and undo this uh, square to isolate uh, r. So I'm going to take square root on both uh, sides and here square and square root undo each other. So therefore our radius r turns out to be square root of 246. So therefore our this radius r turns out to be square root of 246. Likewise this radius r turns out to be square root of 246 as well. And now let's make an observation. We can see the area of this uh, green shaded region is going to be equal to the area of this uh, quarter circle minus uh, the area of this uh, square OABC. 
And now we know that the area of the square OABC has been given to us uh, as uh, 123 centimeters square. So therefore our only task is to calculate the area of this uh, quarter circle. And now we are going to calculate the area of this uh, quarter circle. And now let's recall the area of a circle formula. Area equals to pi r square where r is the radius of this uh, quarter circle. And since we are dealing with this uh, quarter circle, so therefore uh, quarter circle area is going to be this area divided by 4. So I can write uh, pi r square divided by 4. So therefore the area of this uh, quarter circle is going to be pi divided by 4 times the radius of this quarter circle is square root of 246. So I can write uh, square root of uh, 246 uh, whole uh, square. And here we can see square and square root undo each other. So therefore we are ended up with the 200. Uh, 46 pi divided by 4 and if I reduce the right hand side that is going to give us 123 pi divided by 2 centimeter square. So thus the quarter circle area turns out to be 123 pi divided by 2. And here's our final step. Let's go ahead and calculate the area of this green shader region. And we already figured out uh, our quarter circle area as uh, 123 pi divided by 2. And the area of this uh, square OABC is uh, 123. So we are going to fill in the blanks in this uh, given equation. So our quarter circle area is uh, 123 pi divided by 2 minus uh, the square OABC area is uh, 123 and now we can see 123 and 123 they are in uh, common so therefore I'm going to factor out uh, 123 outside and inside this parenthesis we are going to have uh, pi divided by 2 minus uh, 1 centimeter uh, square so therefore after all the manipulations and calculations uh, the area of this uh, green shaded region uh, turns out to be 123 times uh, in parentheses pi divided by 2 minus 1 uh, centimeter square. And in terms of uh, decimals the area of this green shaded region is going to be approximately equal to 70.2 centimeter square. And that's our final answer. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.